Hello everyone. So you guys asked for more food videos. So with that said everyone, I am not by any food brands for this video. I'm making this video because there are people out there that love food and they need to emphasize food now. So with that said everyone time is for a snack one of my top favorite blends of chips that I love to eat because not only that is GMO friendly but it is vegan friendly and this one is the new we all know twelve point sea salt is really not new come on it's just new to put it on a chip but does these chips actually have truffle sea salt on them? I'm pretty sure that it does have sea salt, but it may have some essence, some truffle spray. Yes, if you guys don't know what truffle spray is, basically the, the, the abstract of the liquid that has been left over and is they, they use it as to spray over potato chips in the factory. When they are being processed and made and cooked, so in the last, I, I believe the last process is they spray it with some truffle, truffle oil spray on these chips. But on the back, all the fun the invitations and descriptions and all the cool stuff about kettle blend, and it's gluten free, which is very important. Now I am not a not against gluten because I have a gluten problem. But uh, certain gluten does make me bloat, so always great to have if you're allergic to gluten. And see, currently, I normally pick these up, but th these chips have two grams of uh, protein, uh, seven percent, which is 160 milligrams of sodium. Uh, it has 10 percent total fat, but the saturation fat, saturation fat is. 0.5 grams which is three percent and you got your polarization your polysaturated fat is fat gram and your mono fat is grams so uh, iron on the other hand is 0 0.4 milligrams which is two percent potassium is 300 milligrams you guys can read I figured that was important for you guys to know before you buy chips. And even when you eat food, if you guys want me to continue to make Mind you, I'm shooting this in 1080p, 60 frames a second. So please, please, really consider it subscribing, ladies and gentlemen, because what I do on this channel is real life situations. I am a documentarian, and I'm waiting for the next big job opportunity for me with the right employer this time. So everyone I am in New York birthday is in three days from now I'm also having some complications with my transportable uh, wagon here with the wheels coming off this core so I'm very disappointed with that but for some of the donations yeah I want to say thank you. before we even start eating the food I really want to say thank you for literally taking the time out listen and opening your minds because there are a lot of people that are mind on the platform people say what's this video about and it's, it goes to show you that some people are not really willing to pay attention to the details and the surroundings of the video so, if you subscribe it really does help it, it helps so much for this channel you you let the aqua ripple know it's important just like everyone else yes be fair you two so with that said everyone you open these and this is not the first time. Actually, this is my. But with that said, everyone, uh, let's talk. Let's just grab. Which. Let me show you what it looks like. As you can see, it looks like a regular kettle. A crinkly. It's actually crinkling cut. And mind you guys, I got into a car. But I lost my dentures, actually got stolen my dentures, and I haven't been using it, but my gums are strong. 
I prove it to you. That is some strong gums to bite into some crinkly teeth, uh, crinkly chips cut. But we also got some Sabrina avocado. The reason I did healthy alternatives. I need I need oil is a bonus. Well, even though it's spray. Really will help with detoxifying my liver and giving me the nutrients for my stomach. It has a combination of tomatoes, which is a vitamin C, red peppers, which is vitamin C, garlic, which stomach. Because we've been food poisoned, we still are kind of in the food poison state. I'm pretty sure I'm going to have to use the bathroom afterwards. So. I'm gonna try one of the chips. Oh wow, this one is spicy. I felt that. I thought that no, that's when I know that the spicy. The chip. Not bad. I would have preferred if I would have got the regular original avocado without the spice because just like you know this is also non GMO by as well. So just in curious about this guacamole. Yes. It's a pretty early late morning here in Long Island City. Dip it again. Give it a nice one. Nice dip. Yeah that should be good. That that looks Not bad. bad. Never dip, please. If you the hell you want. If you have the double episode. Here, here's the thing the price may throw you off in certain locations but I'll tell you a price difference the market over here sells this guacamole I went to what was it Astoria last after doing a live stream late, I couldn't sleep, guys. I, 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 can't, I can't sleep with the stomach pain and the diarrhea and the food poison. But I went all the way to the store to look for a community fridge. I decided, you know what? I'm going to spend the money because this is why it's so warm. It's not cold. But guess what? I only spent $4 on this. At another budget market. $4. So this neighborhood, Long Island City, is quite expensive. So, yeah, and you guys asked for more food videos. So, this is my this is my first part.
we did the ramen. Well, it was not my first start. We have done a few, few movie, a few, few movie. Uh, uh, sorry. Live streams about food, but you guys are asking and requesting for like, yeah, you do more foods. I want to do more foods, but a healthy alternatives. Because friends of ours, they are trying to currently right now. We have a one friend currently. She's exercising using. So it's hard to eat right and smart. But don't, don't eat this all throughout the day. This is just like a teaser snack. Mm. And also drink some great. Reason why I want to your food poison or you have any troubles with your stomach, that is purified great aid water. Definitely gonna help your your dehydration problem. The sound is going chop chop in and out. Really, the microphone and the receiver right here. I don't know, friend. I don't know what to tell you. Right here. The, but anyway, let's press the microphones up here, maybe. Yeah, you guys want me to talk louder. That's the thing. And I'm not really want to talk louder than the microphones. DB volume. I'm, I guess I'm saying that right. I'm sorry, I didn't sleep last night. It's really hard when it's so hot and humid. And not only that, you're dealing with your food poison. But now I'm dealing with the wheels coming off the off my wagon because of the heat. And me, this is why I didn't want to go anywhere. Because the heat is causing the wheels to come off. So it's actually de-sticking. De-sticking that glue that's on the rubber. Yeah, so it's pretty unfortunate. But do I recommend these? Uh, yeah, but don't eat them all in one day or two days. Snack on them as a snack not at your dinner or your lunch or your breakfast <laughs> with that said everyone enjoy the rest of your 101 degree weather here in New York City and wish me luck everybody thank you for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video you guys take care Happy shooting.